she's singing in the rain, just singing in the rain. What, what a beautiful feeling, I'm happy again. I'm not happy about going home. Oh, I'm glad you're not happy about going <laughs> home. That means you've had a really good time. I've had a great time. Yeah, so we're going to stow away. final part of our cruise. Don't know what happened to the audio this bit so I'm going to do some talking as you can see. We've got up in time for breakfast in the buffet with a spectacular if wet view of Rotterdam. I have to say breakfast in the buffet that morning was pretty good and certainly set us up for the day. Although it does look a bit wet out there. And there's Dan to Jacqueline enjoying a bit of orange juice. So let's see what we get up to. It's not such a beautiful day here in Rotterdam but they gave us brollies. Exciting. And we're just taking a little stroll um, to buy some gifts for people. Yay! The umbrellas. Yes. That's it. What about? What time is it? Eleven uh, ish? Yeah. We've got to be back on the ship by one, but we're really not going to be very long. We did 35,000 steps yesterday. Yeah, well, Jacqueline did 35,000 because she also did a run, but I didn't. I stayed in bed. <laughs> and Jacqueline thinks, seems to think we're going swimming. We are. Because the, the pool open. is open. The but we'll see. Pool's open. Maybe they'll shut it by the time we get back on. <laughs> and you can go for a run, can't you? I don't want to. Uh, we'll go this way. Look, can you see? There she is in the background. Where, where's Auntie Jacqueline? Oh, I'm at the air height. Oh, hi. <laughs> Auntie Jacqueline. <laughs> Everyone's Auntie. Oh, oh, that's quite cute. No. You could be the cruise. Can't afford that. You could be the cruise Auntie. We're the cruise Auntie. Yeah. <laughs> uh, right, we've just spent a small fortune in the local tat shop. So, um, those people that are getting their Rotterdam gifts, hope you appreciate them. And the man, they're very friendly here, aren't they? They are they? very friendly. I don't know why it sounds like they're very friendly here. Yeah. Oh, you went Irish <laughs> yeah, now? Yeah, Irish now. Not Queen Elizabeth. No? Uh, I would say they're very friendly and they all speak very good English. So, <laughs> yeah. Good job, really, isn't it? Um, so, our plans now chill out on Swim. the gym. Oh. Or go to the gym. And then we've got, I've brought some cards and we're going to play some cards in the crow's nest. She thinks she's going to get a seat in the crow's nest. <laughs> it's really early. <laughs> well, when are we swimming then? I don't know. <laughs> and then I'd have to wash my hair. Ah, no, no. <laughs> uh, anyway, we're going to take a walk back because it's not, not much else to do, really. No, but you got three umbrellas. The umbrellas are working out. She's singing in the rain. Just singing in the rain. What a beautiful feeling, I'm happy again. I'm not happy about going home. Oh, I'm glad you're not happy about going <laughs> home. That means you've had a really good time. I've had a great time. Yeah, so we're going to stow away. <laughs> no, I think we said we're going to try a different show. Yeah, we've already started looking. We were looking. Sorry, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, pay your fare, come and join us. Um, yeah. No, it's only um, yeah, you can pay people for that. Boarding school. <laughs> uh, yeah. Get, maybe drop us a comment on them um, short cruises you recommend. Because this, this is just right, I think, yeah, for what like we wanted. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, we're going to walk back because it's bloody miserable. See you on board. playing cards. Helen's having the time of her life. I love playing cards. It makes me so happy. <laughs> mm. 
She says this. She won the first round. Why? Jack and Lemmy. I didn't. Can you keep it tidy? Yeah. Card game went well. Card game went well. We won three out four, but oh, sorry, sort of. We're a part of this. Please let you know that uh, Auntie Jacqueline is trying to work out what cruise she wants to do next. <laughs> <laughs> and we're on the move. So this is it. Bye bye Rotterdam and reality back. <laughs> Going back to reality. And we're chilling. Chilling with my homie. <laughs> In our jumpers. Do a little, do a little sweep. <laughs> Ch chuckling up. <laughs> or is it awful? Back from the crow's nest. And look at Jacqueline looking at his neck with Hawkins on the window sill. <laughs> so you got a new love, Hawkins? No, never. Martin's <laughs> my only love. <laughs> oh, take a foot. I don't know. Is that how Hawkins talks? I feel like you're having a really good deep voice. Okay. I came out of the loo to find Jacqueline talking to the teddy bear. <laughs> I was just asking the teddy bear a question. Did he answer? No. Oh, he's so rude. He's so rude. <laughs> Again, quite quick. What did you say? Quite a lick. Quite a lickety split. Lickety split. Good. This is the warm side. <laughs> it's the warm side. Just sailing away from around somewhere far, far away that way. And we're going far, far away that way. Which way are we travelling, Jade? Yeah, just thought I had to check again. That way. <laughs> oh, Wilson! Doris <laughs> Rapping. Oh, no, my husband is saying freaking shit. Freaking shit. Look how busy it is out there, it's like a motorway of boats. What are we doing, Helen? Torture. <laughs> We're gonna go swimming in the in outdoor, the outdoor pool. pool. Yeah, because there's no one in this one and yeah, it's warm. So why is there nobody in this one? Because they, they're outdoor. too. Right, you're gonna get cold and wet, so you might as well just do it here. Come on, little one. Oh, you're still stood there. Fine, I'll get in then. You can film me in the pool. Oh, that lasted all of about oh, five seconds. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's. Is it? Okay. Okay, so um it felt warm when I put my hands in it. I thought I thought it was on this level. That guy's going in it. Anyway, we're now walking to the indoor pool which I think we've gone up too high. Actually my feet are gonna frozen. It'll feel warm in our feet. Anyway, it was a good idea. It was a great idea. Helen's loving this. The choice was this of going running. She chose swimming. So here we go. We're going to the crystal pool now. I can't feel my feet. Is there more people in here? I don't. It's very busy. It's probably warm enough. Here we are. Take two. <laughs> 
a bit busier, isn't it, than the outdoor pool? Oh, well, I hope that's a good sign, Jacqueline. All right, here we go. I'm going to attempt it again. Okay, so we've been for a swim in the indoor pool and hopefully I've, you've just seen some footage on that. And we went and grabbed some afternoon tea from the buffet, brought that with us down to the cabin whilst we ate that and now we are doing the packing. Boom. So yes, <coughs> it's that sad day when the suitcases all appear in the corridor and everyone prepares to go back to reality bit of movement for sure the captain's certainly taken the ship back home quicker than he took us out how are you doing Jacqueline? Okay. Mm. But, you know making plans for future cruises so yeah. that's exciting so the plan pack we'll get ready for dinner and then we're gonna go to the Alexandria at half past six for our last MDR meal and then we're gonna probably have a little drink and reflection somewhere quiet huh yeah Dancing no dancing day. tonight. Got to get a good kip, get ready to get off the ship. We've got to be out of the cabin by eight. We want to grab a sit down breakfast and then we'll be on the road. But we'll, we'll take you on that journey. It's really, I've had a shower since swimming. She's had a shower since swimming. Here we go, we're all dressed up. Packing's pretty much done, just the stuff that we need for the morning. Look at how lovely Jacqueline looks. <laughs> and we are going to go for dinner. We're going to have a wander out there now, aren't we, really? Yeah. <laughs> hey, Jacqueline, what you got? Can I be rings? Can I ring? Rings. Oh, you nearly added there, poor thing. Nom, nom, nom. Nom, nom, nom. What you got? Got steak, chips, and beans. It's your favourite, isn't it? <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Aurora Desert. Desert Why are you, desert. Why are you talking in a what is that accent? I'm not really sure. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what you got here? A pan panna cotta? Panna cotta with honeycomb and strawberry juice. Oh yeah. <laughs> are we excited about this? And Jacqueline thought she'd go and try something. We have different. the same. <laughs> Same meal for the third night in a row. Yeah. No, we, I ate more dessert than you. Yeah. yeah. Apparently, my honeycomb looks better. Just about to have a cup of tea. And uh, yeah, I need to show you this. Look how cute this sugar spoon is. Apparently, I can't take that home. Alright, go and have a bite. Okay. Live tasting. I'm looking forward to having my dessert now. Alright. Go all the way around. Thank you. Congratulations. Welcome back. Um, Helen has jumped to the toilet for the... <laughs> I don't know how many times I'm left on my own just staring into my glass. That's why I've been drinking so much. Helen, how was that toilet? Uh, well, it's a theatre toilet, and earlier that theatre toilet was a plushy fix, and then it was absolutely fine. It's just a paper toilet. So, we're still going with the playhouse? 
So, if you're ever on the Aurora, the Playhouse Toilets is the one to go to if you're not near your cabin. Is that the correct assumption? Yes. Okay. You heard it here first. Bye! So we've had a really chilled afternoon, we've been, you've seen we've been swimming, we went for our last sit down in the MDR, we, I haven't really had any drinking, no dancing, we went and saw a, a guy singing in Carmen's. Yep, seems pretty alright. Yeah, so quite chilled and relaxed, um, just getting our heads around being, going back to reality tomorrow. So Jacqueline, this is your first ever cruise, let's have your thoughts of the cruise. Thoughts, thoughts of the cruise. Um, really enjoyed it. Really enjoyed switching off and um, not having my phone distracting me. So we had some really good conversations. Yeah, I think we sorted um, the world out. I totally sorted the world out. But we've also just kind of chilled out and just not talked. If that sounds a bit weird, isn't it? But enjoyed yeah, each other's company. That's yeah, and we've. Um, I think. I would like to try another one. I think I've said this before with the kids. Um, yeah, it's been really nice not having my phone. What do you think of the ship? If I'm honest, it's okay. And I like our cabin. I quite, the cabin's nice. Um, but I think I was a bit surprised about how small the dark, like the kind of part the disco room was mm -hmm. um, and I think we spoke about this like whether it's the age of the people on here or whether like you say it's going for refurbishment it did feel a little bit tired in places mm -hmm. but um, I've managed to navigate round and I've got my head around it which I don't think you have no uh, I find it a really confusing ship to find my way around <laughs> because Lee mo walking to the back of the ship and we're trying to get to the front that's and you do have to do a lot down, not yeah. down and stuff. Um, yeah, I like the ship. The gym was good. The running around the track was fine. Um, that was that was exciting to do. And yeah, we managed to get in the swimming pool today. That was nice. Um, yeah, the ship's nice. I think it's like you say, it's a nice introduction to cruising. And I'm glad I did it on this ship. But you've got more experience, so hearing others about other ships, it makes more sense for families. Yeah, I think this, I like, the ship's nice for a little, like, what we've done, yeah. a four-nighter, um, but it is, it is tired in places, there have been problems with the toilets flushing, there's obviously been some sort, something's happened in Carmen's, because there's a whole area that was having, like, yeah. things dried and found and, and water yeah. damage, <clears throat> but she, in terms of cruise ship, she is old, she does have a real, she's a pretty ship, and she does have some really timeless classic yeah. lines to her, which is nice. I wouldn't want to spend I like, I like Anderson's yeah. bar was quite nice. Yeah, that's what I mean. It's got yeah. that classic kind of old worldy. It is attracting an older clientele. It's not like the MSC Virtue, is it? It's not a party ship. I mean, we, we made kind of turned yeah, it into that. Yeah. It's been a bit of a boozy one. Um, would I come on a hurry again? Possibly for a little cruise. Wouldn't do any more than four nights. Um, I'm looking, I, looking forward to see what Iron is like because that'll be the newest and biggest ship this fleet I'll be on. Mm. I think at the moment I would be, I'm starting to feel like I'm being drawn to MSC a little bit more. Okay. But who knows. I like the British reservedness of the P&O cruises. <laughs> yeah, the service, I, I think the service was, was fine. There's bits where we've waited a long time for a drink. Yeah, Crow's Nest in particular yeah. was a bit slow. The speed of the MDR tonight oh my was, God. I don't know what's been said to them, but they were like, they were on whether they fire. just didn't everyone out. <laughs> They were whizzing us through today, which actually made it quite. Yeah. Ooh. And we're still sat there and they're cleaning the table. Yeah. Um, but I liked it. Yeah. It's been fun. It's just been really chilled. And Rotterdam, Rotterdam I've really enjoyed. Yeah, a little um, bit. It feels like that's a little gem that d gets overlooked. Yeah, and definitely worth a second visit to do yeah. a bit more. Yeah, definitely. Sunday is a good day to visit. Yes. Monday, today, Monday, Rotterdam was feeling a bit busier. Not that we went very far into it. So Sunday is a good day because the shops are still open till much later than British shops in Rotterdam and unlike the rest of Europe. Yeah. Um, but it it's was quieter, so quieter probably on the roads. He said it'd be a good day to see on bikes. Yeah. Because it was the thing. roads weren't as busy. <laughs> or go running. 
or get a water taxi, which we never did. We didn't do that. So that's we've got a little list of things we want to do on the next one. Uh, all packed up, our suitcases have gone out the cabin. It's just about getting up, going for breakfast and going home tomorrow morning. So we'll vlog a bit of that. Otherwise, it's good night. Good night for me, Anna. Good night for me. Good morning. It's disembarkation day today. Mm. Oh, it's not even on the second of the season. Is it one of the mid? No, I think it is on the. Yeah. Okay. Mm. <laughs> um. So it's time to say goodbye to our cabin. So um, just to point out that these beds are amazing. They are so comfy. Amazing pillows. Oh, there's a ship going by. Sorry, easily distracted. Squirrel. Um, I don't reckon much on the air conditioning though. Considering we had this room set on the lowest possible setting, like it should have been Arctic, I didn't feel it was Arctic. Jacqueline, however, has a different there view. There moments. She feels it, at times it was quite cold. I never felt that. So, bye bye, really cool window. Really like that. Hawkins enjoyed being on watch, didn't you, Hawkins? No, I want to go home to Martin. Um, bye bye, little sofa that we never sat on. Bye bye, mirror that could definitely do with a brighter light for makeup purposes. Bye to the single plug that we could find. So if you are going to have this room, really recommend buying one of those um, multi-charging plugs because that was a godsend, really, wasn't it? It was because the other one was because the other plug reach. that we found was right up there behind the jelly. We couldn't find any other plugs, but maybe that's just us. Bye bye bathroom. Hang on. Ta -da! And for those who know, one cheek, two cheek, ra ra ra. Don't get sucked down. No no no. And I have to say, that is a really good shower. Just make sure you tuck the shower curtain in, like I forgot to do this morning, and create a small flood. Yeah, that was me. So, uh, bye bye cabin. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you. Really liked you. And now it's time to go and get some breakfast and hey. leave. Oh. Make like a tree and leave. Hawkins is waiting for his breakfast and he's been very patient because Jacqueline's gasping for a cup of tea. See, I ordered a hot chocolate. What's a cup of tea? It seems crazy in here. It does, doesn't it? But no, nothing's happening. Nothing, yeah. There's a lot of rushing around, but now it's occurred. And <laughs> we sat here a little while. We have ordered. Oh dear. <laughs> Where shall we go? Let's just stay up here. Breakfast. She's got, she's got the breakfast. It's breakfast. But what haven't you got? I haven't got a cup of tea. I've asked five times now. Shit's all open now. Hey, Jacqueline. Oh, Well, I'm a rebel. <laughs> no filming, ma'am. All right. <laughs> so go for it. Bye, Aurora. I, I don't think it was like exactly blazing sunshine when we just come from. Yeah, it's true. We didn't have to come out. <laughs> Uh, so 5F, oh it should be just here. Yeah, yeah. No, that's not mine, that's yours. Oh, there's one over there. Should we just like park over here? Hmm? Gonna get one over now. See, your birthday's over now, so you can do all the work. Someone doesn't want to go home. <laughs> yeah, go back over Just there. dump them. <laughs> right. right, let's go all then.
right there. Do you want to swap? What are you doing? I'm getting my parking ticket out. It's like that. Ooh. And then I'm going to go and get the keys to the car. That's handy, isn't it? So I'm going. I know someone doesn't want to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a ship. It's the car park. A, B, C, D, E. Well done, babe. What comes after it? I learned my alphabet. <laughs> I'll keep always just filming the bottom half of your face. <laughs> there she is. There's the Aurora. Back in the car park. Same car park we got off when Martin and I went on Ventura. 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 So, bye-bye, Aurora. Here she is already in the car. Lovely, isn't it? Beautiful weather. Look at the state of my door. <laughs> Might just dry that. Um, so that's it. End of. I'm gonna take these glasses Cruises. off. <laughs> no, Cruise aunties. Cruise aunties. Because there's already sisters on the sea. Always so there to make sure you have a good time. <laughs> and be slightly pissed. <laughs> Drunk. Drunk. Anyway, so that's it. End of our cruise. Well done, Auntie Jacqueline, and thank you. Thank you, Auntie Helen. <laughs> So we're back to being aunties on the seas, to, or cruise aunties, back to being brave for these adventures now because in just over three months is the rather epic Glastonbury and that will be starring Martin, Finley, Dion yeah. and myself. I don't know what um, Wilson's adventures are going to be doing. Cotswolds. Oh, no, you've got a Norwegian adventure. Yeah, that's, you and your that's, girls. That's me and but that my girl that's leaves. not going to be vlogged. It might do. <laughs> And who knows what little adventures might occur between now and Glastonbury. But please like, subscribe, comment your thoughts, any tips, any suggestions. You know, we've asked you for suggestions on short breaks, short cruise breaks that maybe our mum would like. We're thinking Cunard. We're also contemplating another Norwegian cruise maybe next year as well, or Jacqueline is. And maybe Martin and I will be able to join her on that. Um, but thank you for watching. Uh, stay tuned for further braid for easy adventures but it's for, bye for now from us bye. and it's a bye from aurora bye. bye thank you so much for sticking with us and watching through to the end of the series really hope you've enjoyed our little adventure on here now aurora like we did but please stick with us because coming up in the next few months we've got the epic glastonbury festival we've got a week in tenerife and we've also got a two-week cruise on my own around in Spain and Portugal. Who knows what else we'll get up to? So like, subscribe, stick with us. Thank you so much. This is brought to you by Braid Feasy Adventures, keeping it real just for you.